Hi everybody! So today it's not updating time, no new features, no nothing. Um, I want to know your opinion on a thing. And this is because um, on my latest video I had some reactions um, on the um, so-called hidden features. Um, what you see here is the compressor too. And um, it has a hidden feature. For example, if you click the uh, left half of this display, you get the view meter and for the view meter you have a semi hidden feature uh, which is the screw on the top right which adjusts the um, needle speed for this view meter if you click here again you get back to this graphics thing and so on and such exists in some of my plugins so the question is how should we handle these hidden features or unlabeled features that I put in these screws or um, things like that. And um, the first uh, thing that came to my mind was if you put your mouse hovering the Tukan logo, um, some tool tips will appear that um, will um, tell you uh, where the hidden features are. But I didn't think that was so cool because you're often passing this um, Tukan logo and don't want to, to have these nasty tooltips everywhere. So I decided um, to make it um, on the um, keyboard button F1, as it is uh, assumed to be the help button in um, the, or most of the um, software I know. So if I press F1, we see uh, general information for fine-tuning knobs, um, press shift. Uh, to reset knobs, um, press control or command on the Mac. And then it tells you, oh, well, this screw is the soft knee screw, um, the dry mix or parallel mix for compression. You can adjust at this screw and view meter speed here. If you click here, you get the view meter. And um, to reset these red values, um, click here. And um, the info labels stay there until you click uh, the plugin again, um, that would be one idea. So now I changed the code a bit, and um, here's the second idea. And this idea is um, again press F1, it's more simple, and an info box appears which tells you uh, this screw next to ratio is knee, this screw next to output is parallel mix. So it's just a, um, a info. Uh, where you can uh, see what's going on there if you've forgotten um, one of these features. I already um, answered uh, two questions like um, how do I know the hidden features uh, in the YouTube comments, like I will make something like that. Um, and there were people um, telling me to make a um, menu thing. Um, I've done that here, um, like this. And uh, I right click uh, on the plugin, and um, then I have this menu where I can say display with a slow needle or a normal needle and fast needle, or I want this graph with um, values. And then I could set uh, the knee factor for soft, medium, or hard, um, parallel compression. And this is where it gets tricky because some of the features um, that are not really hidden but placed in these little screws um, are things that are um, adjustable. So here you could only set uh, to um, some kind of decibels or a bit more or full or things like that. And um, you can adjust the screws and uh, however you like on this um, knee screw. You see that here on the knee value, if I turn that up, um, so that would not be given if I made uh, things like that. People told me um, that it would be better uh, instead of, uh, of these info labels everywhere um, to have uh, a um, menu where you can uh, set these things. Um, and they said it's because while mixing, they don't want to read but I can't really understand that because how is that not reading? So um, I put a, a little survey in the um, community YouTube 
thing thing i'll link that in the description and um well there you can tell me um what uh, what would you suggest or uh which of the solutions would you uh like to see that's it for today i hope you still have fun with the plugins and bye bye <laughs>